And this right next to my form room, this this was the tuck shop. It's I can't walk in there because it's it's secured and it's got glass glass windows and doors here. But that was the tuck shop. This was all open originally. You could you could walk, just walk through here. And this here, this was the entrance to the home ec. All the home ec rooms were upstairs. And uh, this, it's a bit of a shame now. Have a look at this. It's, it seems to have gone to, to rack and ruin. It's kind of all just fallen to bits there, which is a uh, <clears throat> bit of a shame. bit of a shame, really. This was Oxley State High. And uh, Oxley State High then became Oxley Secondary College. And then it became a fire aunt fire ant center and uh, then it was closed off which is I always looking back on the high school you think oh, I wasn't that good yeah it had its problems it was it was a bit of a lower socio-economic sort of group school um, and I, I lived in a very middle 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 class area and uh, I was probably probably one of the more affluent students and uh, this area here was in Oxley which Oxley's become incredibly expensive become expensive but uh, it was a bit of a shitter of a school at the time but uh, looking back on it I do have some good memories there were some really good memories here and uh, that's B block that's right B block just having a bit of a, a look here I think I can't believe is look how much the the greenery has gone wild here fuck these was these were kind of a lot smaller I never remember that big tree there <coughs> quite amazing really I don't remember that big tree and then of course these were the science blocks. Let's have a look. They were the science that went to that's the big science complex. And that was the library. The library. I remember I used to like the library as a kid. Yeah, the library was really cool. And over here, this was the manual arts. That was the just behind me now is the manual arts block. So this was technical drawing, metalwork, woodwork, manual arts block. And uh, it's kind of sad to see it in a state of this in, in really run down now. But uh, I remember it well. And uh, I remember there was a senior mistress, Mrs. Glad Gladwell, I think her name was. She was a... She used to love the roses and uh, she used to grow the roses. These remains here were roses that she um, planted and, and had the students maintain. So it's kind of kind of sad to see them dying out there. They were so they were so lovely years ago and kind of strange to see this now this this block is all um, it's all old I remember I remember doing uh, graphic arts C1 C1 that's right <clears throat> I remember doing graphic arts that was sort of like CAD before CAD you know <laughs> a pencil you'd, you'd, you'd design things and uh, I remember doing technical drawing and sort of that was the um, the block for it there. I remember doing. I used to like that. I like technical drawing. You'd measure and you'd do this and that. This is all before computers. All before computer age there. So it's uh, quite quite eerie. Quite eerie walking around here. You think, Jesus, look at that place. It's really <clears throat> fallen down here. And uh, this this was the the admin block. And right behind that was the assembly hall which is very 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 70s in appearance and uh, 
the bad kids would smoke the bad kids would smoke underneath underneath the hall there that's where the the bad lads would smoke and uh it seems like yesterday coming here now just seems seems like like yesterday indeed but uh this was over 30 years ago now 1985 1985 and uh we'll just come up here this was the um this was the graphic arts room cool jeez that was the graphic arts room here so i i would have used these port racks as well here port racks so it uh brings back brings back a lot of memories coming and having a sticky beak at these grounds here it's kind of sad you know they, they it was a it was a nice very beautiful grounds they had here very um relaxed you know just nice grounds in that there it's sad that it's not not being utilized now it was really quite uh it's quite sad that it, it it's kind of gone to waste you know you, you see could they do something with it could you turn this into like homeless shelter or something could you surely you can do something with it instead of it going to rack and ruin it's it was uh these are expensive buildings you know they're, they're, they're not they're not cheap it was quite it's certainly fallen into uh disrepair now but it was it was very very usable up until about um it's very it's been very usable here so it's kind of sad to see the whole area falling into uh just nothing just nothingness